cafe mocha regular? Isabel Munez loves coffee. Really any kind of coffee. The smell of coffee, especially one with mocha. But holding her cup steady used to be a challenge. Before I couldn't hold a cup of coffee like this. Isabel has a disease known as essential tremors. The disease is debilitating, causing the person to shake when they hold objects. Up until the past October, Isabel has learned to live with her condition. That's when she went through a surgery that changed her life. I had seen online the outcome of the surgery, and like I told you, there was never a doubt whether I wanted the surgery. Isabel decided to have a surgery to place a deep brain stimulation device into her body. This is how it's done. This battery pack is placed under the skin in either the stomach or near the collarbone. Then this wire is passed through the neck up to the brain. The device is controlled by a remote outside the body, which can turn the device on or off. It's like a pacemaker for the brain. It, it blocks abnormal currents inside the brain. Doctors say the device helps patients who have essential tremors or Parkinson's disease. The technology has been around for more than a decade, but it's a relatively new procedure to hospitals in the valley. The Edinburgh Regional Medical Center recently acquired training and equipment to offer the procedure. Isabel was the second patient to get the device, and since October, about two patients a month get the surgery. It's here and it's going to stay ever, forever, because it's a very effective um, procedure. More than 13,000 people in South Texas suffer from Parkinson's and essential tremors. Most are on medications to control their symptoms, but once medication stops working, surgery is a permanent and life-changing option. Even now, I'll find myself doing things and I'll get choked up thinking, you know, a year ago I couldn't do this. The device does need occasional adjustments, but overall patients are happy with the results. Absolutely. Changes uh, uh, lives for the better. The reaction of Isabel's son tells just how drastic the device has changed her life. He knows it's good, but it's strange for him because that's not what he knew his entire life. So, and, I, and I get a tear in my eye and I tell him, you know, I thank God I had the surgery. Isabel says not only has she stopped shaking, but she has been given control of a part of her life she felt powerless against. In Edinburgh, Nadia Galindo, Action 4 News.